Hello friends, DCY Steza here, bringing you Request to Build Episode 6, where today... Is it 6? I think it's 6. Let's say it's 6. It might be 5. No, it's 6. I'm going to have faith that it's 6. Um, where today we're going to be doing, uh, as requested by someone on the channel, we are going to be doing energy generators and energy links. Da -da -da -da. Energy generators and energy links. Now the reason why someone has requested me for to do this is because people just don't get Billcraft industrial power differences. Don't ask me why, it just don't happen. Um, for those of you who are interested, that is the Island Survival over there. Copy and paste it over to a new world so we can continue our fun that we were once having on that island. So let's get started. I am on creative, so don't be posting in the comments saying, You're on creative! Because, very perceptible of you. Um, let's get started. So all I'm going to do is, I'm going to be getting us, um, Buildcraft power input. So I can demonstrate the power of Buildcraft power input. Um, I was going to build a little safety thing, but I've just decided, right now, right this second, that I can't be asked. Uh, well, let's go and get some power cabling. So I got, I think I've got everything here I'm going to need. I'm almost certain that I've forgotten something. Um, so let's get some Billcraft power going. So this is Billcraft power. So Billcraft power comes from these power piping. Ooh, power piping is just basically piping with redstone on it. It's very simple. Um, oh, don't do that. Um, so you want to use gold. If you're using stone, then GG. Because uh, stone loses so much power per block that it becomes no longer worth it. Um, gold is just about worth it. You don't want to pipe these things for more than 10 or 15 blocks. Or as it gets ridiculous. Um, so what we're going to do is uh, we'll, we'll set that up and then we'll uh, we'll just go like this to get some uh, lavas going. Give me some lavas. Right then. I just realised we're going to need some oil, aren't we? We're going to need some bloody oil. Let's get some oil then. So people uh, people seem to be struggling with this. Oh, I'm going to need a lot more than that, aren't I? <laughs> People seem to be struggling with this because they just don't understand the difference between build craft and industrial craft power. Industrial craft and build craft are two separate mods. They are in the tech it because of the brilliant people over at tech it <laughs> who managed to program them together. They weren't actually designed to be together originally, although now I hear that the modders are doing a lot of work together, which is awesome. You always like to see modders working together. But the point is that they both use different kinds of power. Um, now, I don't think you'll have anybody argue that industrial craft power is better. Um, you won't have anyone argue against that because it is. If you don't think so, then you're wrong. Um, I mean, I like industrial, I, I like build craft powers, actually the next person, and I'm using it currently on the island, uh, island survival because we have oil. But if you've got like infinite resources and you're looking to power something insanely big, then you use industrial craft power because it's just more efficient. Um, but that's not what this video is all about. This video is about showing you the difference and showing you how to set it up. So let's, uh, uh, let's get all this in our inventory. Uh, right. Um, it's just occurred to me though that I'm going to have to come over here and click that to do it because I'm on creative. Um, so let's move some of these bad boys over like this. Oh god, here we go. Yeah, this is amazing. Right. Look at this. Right. So you have three different kinds of engine generators. You have the high voltage, medium voltage and low voltage. And that is exactly what they are. They are... These boxes put out energy of the equivalent power as stated on the box. So if you've got a low voltage uh, engine generator, it creates low voltage. If you have a medium voltage energy generator, guess what? It makes medium voltage. Um, so that's pretty simple when you're looking to, to wire this up to machines. If I've got macerators over here, then I want to use low voltage. Because if you don't, i like demonstrate now, like so. Oh, you know, I'm gonna pipe this out like that. I'm gonna have a macerator here. This, this seems like a really good idea. I don't think anything could possibly go wrong here. Let's just have a quick look. Let's just have a quick look at what could possibly go wrong. Because, uh... Oh, shit! <laughs> so, uh, macerators can only accept low voltage. And because I had a medium voltage uh, generator, it didn't work! 
Um, so let's put a medium voltage down and we're stuck down at another macerator there. So basically what is happening here is these uh, combustion engines are pumping onto this wooden. You've always got to be a wooden. If you want to watch a safe build for combustion engines, okay, for power, then go on to my videos, click on the bit, the place, uh, the blah, 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 blah. Click on the playlist that says why Buildcraft doesn't suck, and on there is a 100% safe combustion engine build that consists of a pump set up with three engines, and it will not explode as long as you follow the video that I've done. Okay, so all you out there who say combustion engines will eventually explode, it is guaranteed. You're wrong! Uh, so go and check on that video. Um, it's amazing, if I do say myself. Uh, 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 if I do say so myself. Sorry, I've had a lot of energy drinks today. Uh, I'm feeling quite energetic. Um, I also get to go home tomorrow, so woo! Uh, but anyway, so this is pumping power into here. You can always tell if it's pumping power because you can see the blue lights. As you can see, the blue light is there. The thicker this blue light is, the more power is being made. But, you know, we know how much power is being made because we're clever and we brought an EU reader with us. So this is going into one side of the um, engine generator. Engine generator? Engines. Generator. Engine generator. Oh, oh, clever, clever modders. So this turns Billcraft power, which is these pipes, into industrial power, which is these pipes. It cannot do it the other way. Okay, as far as I'm aware, in 1.2.5, okay, they may have changed in the future, but in this mod, it don't work the other way, goddammit. So you can't make power over here and turn it into Billcraft power. I was showing you how to do that in a minute, using the power of the energy link, so just be patient. So as you can see, oh, it's not actually making any power. Oh, it's because it's not actually using any power. Derp. Um, I'll tell you what, let's get rid of this and let's put down a bottom like that. Oh, no, wrong way. Let's try that again. There we go. And as you can see, it's making power. Wow, that was a spike and a half. So it's making about, good lord, about 15 a year a tick. If you want to increase your uh, viewing time, then you just click it once. And then you wait longer and it'll give you an average over the distance you wait so if i click it now it's giving us a much better score so for 13.0.2 it's pretty good for free that's the equivalent to 13 basic solar generators solar, solar panels sorry so that is some not bad power especially if you just got it all sat next to your base which i do over there you know it's just like why not you know why not so now we're going to work the other way around haha <laughs> So, uh, I've just realized I don't have any solar panels. So let's get some on the Blair, on the Tony Blair. Um, let's get rid of these engine generators now. We don't need them anymore. We'll get a nice, mm, yeah, medium. So, cool. Right, we're gonna need our power pipes, which are here. Okay, so I can prove that that is working because this is charging, so. Uh, I will now prove that this method works as well. So here's a, a solar panel. Here's a bit of piping coming off of it. Um, and then we're going to go energy... Okay, I was going to put it there, but it doesn't matter. Energy link. And then we are going to go wooden piping. Golden piping, golden piping. Oh, I don't need that there. And we'll throw down a quarry, just so I can prove to all you viewers at home that the energy link does in fact work. So as you can see, that line, I would say, is ever so slightly thicker than that line. Yeah, it's definitely thicker. And the reason why that is, is because this, a medium voltage puts out 64 EU a tick, and this only puts out 15. So, you know, it's four times, four times as powerful. But this is a medium voltage. Medium voltage are gay to make, okay? Unless you like end game. Oh, I probably want to stop that. But I don't want a big hole in the floor randomly. So that proves that that works. So all you need to do is you need to go industrial power, which is this piping here, or or copper or gold or insulated, you know, whatever you want to use. I use fiberglass because I love fiberglass. I love the fiberglass. Um, and then you want to put it straight into an energy link like this. And then you want to have wooden pipe coming out. Wooden pipe coming out. Has to be wooden pipe, okay? And then you want to have gold coming out the other side. Remember that gold loses I don't know, it's like one EU a tick or something like that per block. It's an insane amount. So you don't want to have too much of this. So you want to have lots of this leading all the way up to where you want it. And then you put the golden pipe. So you don't want to put this right next to this and then have loads of golden pipe. Because that is stupid. Stupid. So that is how you can... So this is industrial power into buildcraft power. And this is buildcraft power into industrial power. So that is basically it. That is... That is it, that's your lot. And that is how you run. So I'll quickly, what I'll do is, I will quickly show you. 
Da na 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 na. I will quickly show you the recipes for these wonderful machines. So engine generators are as follows. Four golden pipes and iron gear, some redstone, redstone engine, and a low voltage transformer. Now the only difference between the intermediate voltage and high voltage is you've got to change the transformer in the middle. I'll just double check that. I'm pretty sure that's right. No, I'm I'm wrong. You need to change the steam engine and the go and the gear. Good lord. Lordy Lord! Let's see what I've got wrong about the high voltage. Nothing. So the high voltage and the medium voltage don't change. It's just the low voltage that's a little bit cheaper. So I wasn't that wrong. I was a little bit wrong. Not that wrong. Um, in terms of the energy link, the... Well, <laughs> what? No, don't want that. The energy link is as follows. The energy link is fairly cheap to make. I've actually already managed to make one on the Island Survival. Um, we'll be doing that in the next video. I've actually made a, a industrial... A, industrial... A build craft engine power generator a jobby over there. You'll see that on the next Silent Survival, so make sure you check that out. Um, so a couple of uh, advanced alloys, some redstone, a couple of cable, golden gears, wooden inductive pipe. Pretty simple stuff, really. So there you go. So that is both powers being converted into their opposites. Um, it's a fairly simple video, but I've had actually quite a few people message me saying uh, help. <laughs> so there you go. Those people who said help, there's your help. Um, this, isn't, this video isn't for everyone, a lot of you people know how to do it, but a lot of you don't, so I think, uh, I think it's been a good video. So, um, I'm going home, like I said, for a couple of days tomorrow, um, going home till Sunday. So the next video, I've got, I've got a couple of videos lined up, so don't worry, there'll be videos going up while I'm gone. Um, check out the Dota giveaway, uh, I'm going to be giving away two chest keys, two keys that open chests in Dota 2 to subscribers, anyone who comments and thumbs up the channel, so make sure you check that video out if you want to win uh, a chess key for Dota 2. Um, and I'll be doing, I'll be deciding who gets those keys on Sunday. Um, so I'll give everybody like half a week to to make sure they get in for the chance to win. It'll just be randomly decided out of everybody who comments and likes um, two keys. And we'll be doing this every like two weeks, maybe three weeks. So. Make sure you check that out. And also check out the uh, Iron Survival, which I should be doing this evening or tomorrow. And yeah, just make sure you stay tuned. So I've been DCY Stezza. You've been amazing. I will see you next time. Hope you enjoyed.